was bisher geschah. Aber ich habe momentan keine andere Chance. Und so geht es weiter. Hallo und wieder herzlich willkommen zum Let's Play von Game of Thrones Episode 4, Sons of Winter. Es geht weiter. <lacht> Wir sind im Streikgespräch mit dem hässlichen Warzenface Griff. Don't believe you. <lacht> You're not the Lord here, Griff. And I'm tired of you pretending you are. You think I'm fucking pretending? Yeah, I think. You know what I think? My brother is ready. I think you need another lesson in humility. Ashlock. Just like your maester here. Careful, Griff. You really don't want to do that. And why the fuck not? You planning to stop me? Who? Ah, you fucking... You're dead, Roderick! I doubt that. Grab him! Don't just stand there! He is not the law! Uh-oh. Now we're fucked. What the hell is this? Uh, my lord, did you get a smile on mine? What are your orders? I'm the only one here who gives the orders! Take their weapons! Shit, take the mace, that I'll mount him. Yeah, where's my weapon? What are you doing? Drop it! Now. This is my hall. You have no right to be here. Oh no. Now that. Wahrscheinlich ist der Meister wirklich der Verräter und der Schwertig da und irgendwas wird passieren. Meister, are you all right? Yes, I think so. My father. We'll go straight to Roose Bolton. He'll flay you and your sister and your own fucking family. Let go of me. Leave Iron Rat. Take your soldiers and get out. Then maybe I'll show you mercy. Das macht er doch nie. I'm not going anywhere. You gonna hurt me? Your friends won't be around forever, Roderick. And when they're gone, I will see that you pay for this. All of you! Don't see him. <coughs> What's it gonna be, Roderick? I'm not like you, Griff. You're right. You are a fucking coward. And find the White Hills to the cellars. No one gets in or out. Coward! Bloody coward! Mach mal einen Gefangenen aus der Spacki gegen meinen Bruder. Word cannot reach High Point. You must be sure of it. Not as long as they still hold Ryan. Kill the Ravens. All of them. The Hornet and Ready. I swear I will. Oh nee. Fuck you and your queen. That's enough. So long as you're in my camp, you will obey my orders. And getting pissed drunk before a mission. Obey? You know what kind That's of ship brain fool does that? One who wants enough. to fucking die out there! Have you lost your damn mind? I am not some animal in a cage! What in the seven bloody hells? Hey, 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 calm down. Calm down. What's going on here? I'm not the one with the problem. It's him. She can't fight like this, Asher. You think I'm too drunk to fight? Or the fuck what do you What are you gonna know? do? Run out there swinging a fucking... Ah! Ooh. Ah! Still think I can't fight? You fucking bitch! Oh, there we go. There's the asshole I remember. Hey, come on, Beska. Leave the poor Let man alone. Let go of me before I break your fingers. Deal with your friend! Was hab ich denn jetzt wieder gehört? You get us all killed. You scared, Croft. This is bloody important. You afraid your mother will spank you? Mind your own business, Croft. You don't need to worry about us. Just take care of this, because if she can't hold it together, we're leaving without the both of you. Super. <laughs> you think your little thumbcock can take Marine all by itself? <sighs> I'd never work with a bloody show like you Beska, anyway! what the hell is going on? <sighs> you gonna lecture me too? <sighs> Croft doesn't know shit <clears throat> about anything. None of you do! 
Will you stop trying to hit me? <laughs> Whatever your problem is with Croft, just let it go. You think this is about Croft? You think I give two shits about what Croft had to say? Oh, my. Uh, cool. Uh, your uh, fucking uh, numbers uh, is the only reason I'm even here. He told your little dragon queen I would go into marine with you. You get me burned by a dragon! I'm doing this for my family, Biscuit. This is oh, the only it's way. It's always about you. Your family. Your problems. Uh, 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 Come on, Asha. Uh, Hit me. Uh, <coughs> oh, if this was a real fight, you'd be dead. I'm not going to do that. Okay, wenn sie so weitermacht, schlage ich hier wirklich nur meine Fresse. What the? So what? You're gonna kill me because you don't want to go into some fucking city. I was a slave. Not here, mir. in this fucking city. I was taken from my home when I was only three in years the eye. old. When I was seven, my master threw me in the fighting pit to die. When my master tired of watching me kill animals for sport, he started... He started sending other children. WTF. I butchered every one of them. I... After a while, I thought the fear was gone. I thought I was used to it. But you had no choice. I did. I decided my life was worth saving. But theirs were not. There was this boy. We used to play five stones in the alley when we couldn't sleep. When I saw him next, he was in that pit with me. I saw the fear in his eyes. That same fear I felt my first time. And I realized it hadn't left me. I still wanted to live. I wanted it so badly. My master watched as I did it. Smiling. I could have killed him for that fucking smile. Yeah. Thank you, little brother. I bought my freedom a long time ago, but I have always hated this place. Hated him. Dezor Zoraza. Because of that man. Marine is a city of dead children. Yeah. Don't worry about me. Das alles aber nicht so viel saufen. I won't let you down. I know you won't. Oh, ich hätte ja, glaube ich, das äh, Saufen wegnehmen sollen. Wobei manche äh, kämpfen ja besser, wenn sie besoffen sind. I'm not sure. You shouldn't say that. Oh, die wieder mit ihrem Lager. Why not? Mira, I'll meet you inside. What are you doing here? I have to get in there, Sarah. I know I'm not supposed to attend. But then you know Lady Marjorie doesn't want to see you. What could be so important? I need to speak with Lords Morgrin and Andros. One of them might be working against my family. Doing what? If I knew that, I wouldn't be here. Lady Marjorie would be furious, Mira. I can't. I'm sorry. I want to help you. But I can't risk it. I'll take the blame. 
You can tell Marjorie I snuck in and you tried to stop me. She's already thinking about replacing you. Are you sure you want to risk it? I have to. <sighs> All right. Marjorie's own ah. Noch. Die will gar nicht den Moral abspielen. She's with me. We'll stay out of trouble. I promise. Wie soll ich jetzt rausfinden, wer gegen meine Familie ist? Wahrscheinlich ist es diese Flowers Bitch noch und kriegt einen Haufen Kohle. Oder der Typ, mit dem die Flowers rumlaufen. It's a bit strange to celebrate, doesn't it? Not so long ago, King Joffrey sat on the Iron Throne. Tommen is our king now. Long may he reign. Sarah! I was worried you'd run off with your friend there. And what if I did? I'm not sure I could blame you. This is Lady Mira Forrester. Mira, Lord Garibald Tarwick. She's quite lovely. Uh oh. Where have you been hiding her? You're making her blush. <laughs> you flatter me. Sarah's lovelier than us all. I won't argue there. It's quite a feast, isn't it? Just be careful around the wine. Though I hear you don't partake yourself. It's easy to forget. Nothing you do in King's Landing goes unnoticed. Drink too much once and you're forever the drunken fool. Talk to the wrong people oh, and... Lord Tarwick! <laughs> what was that about? Nothing. That subject isn't fit for your delicate ears anyway. <gasps> My That's ears are that. not we'll delicate. Of course they are. Look how tiny they are. <laughs> Little loads. <Stop> it. <laughs> what? I mean it. Someone caught your eye, Mira? I'm sorry, I, I um, I'm rather thirsty. Oh, allow me. No, I can get it myself. Thank you. If you'll excuse me. This reminds me of the tourney at Lannisport. You wouldn't believe it. You told me this story. But you would have loved it. We danced all evening, drank wine from our helmets. That is it! Andros, you're being ridiculous! It is a lot, but I know how to spend it. Hmm. But how did you manage it? Oops. Lord Whitehill trusts me above all others. That's why I'm the only one he's willing to work with. Uh -huh. Oh, an exclusive deal. How good for you, Andros. Well, I've got my family to consider. When's the last time you even saw your wife, Andros? Kleiner Pisser. Tü, 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 tü. Tü, tü, tü. Pisser. My cook. And why would you ever stop dealing iron? Hmm. Is there no longer a demand for it? I can't imagine that would be the case. <laughs> no need for such wild speculation. I've simply lost interest. I'm moving on to better things, as they say. Hmm, and what would that be? No, no, no. I can see what you're doing. I'm not giving away my secrets just yet. Okay. Gut, da hat zumindest nichts. Ich kann die alle blauschen. I heard he was killed. Right here in the garden. Well. Wasn't he Lannister? One of their guard, but still. Surely they found who did it. No, they haven't caught him yet. Not for lack of effort, mind you. I hear they've spared no expense. 
Ah, den Spacko, den ich da ja stochen habe, haben sie gefunden. Der hat's verdient, der wollte mich umnocken, der Penner. Oh Gott, die zwei. Oh, bla bla bla. <laughs> oh, please, if you'll excuse me. <laughs> Lady Mira, I'm impressed. Impressed with what? Der andere glückt schon wieder. They're currently locked in a cell. Um. I trust this means that you took care of that contract. How did you do it, if I may ask? I wasn't expecting to see you again, if I'm being honest. You must have made quick work of it. If I tell you how I did it, what's in it for me? <laughs> Nothing. But I admire the gall. I do believe King's Landing is rubbing off on you. So, what have you been up to? Enjoying yourself? Though I suppose if you're talking to me, you must want something. I noticed you and Andros arguing earlier. I'm sorry you had to see that. I told him it was not the time. What were you arguing about, if you don't mind my asking? Well, a bold question deserves a bold answer, doesn't it? I've been pushed out of the ironwood business. Oh. All thanks to my partner. Bloody imbecile. Andros is now Lud Whitehill's exclusive contact in King's Landing. No matter the fact that I introduced them in the first place. That man would be nothing without me. Why would Lord Andros want to push you out? You found a man he could manipulate. Someone who wouldn't demand an equal share. Lyman Lannister. He's working with a Lannister? A third cousin, to be fair. Whatever Andros is up to, he clearly thinks Lyman can take my place. <laughs> Rickard! Are you done flirting with that handmaiden? We need your opinion here. Oh, leave him alone. Please excuse me. Lyman Lannister, what the fuck? Ih, muss ich jetzt mit dem hässlichen Goldlöckchen flirten? Und ihn äh, versuchen, um den Finger zu wickeln, um für meine Zwecke auszuspielen? Ich glaube, das funktioniert sowieso nicht, weil er ein Lannister ist, mal abgesehen davon. Ja, was uns noch zu erwartet, sehen wir dann im nächsten Part. Vielen Dank fürs Zusehen und bis dahin. Ciao, ciao.